If some of you guys don't already know, I announced it on Facebook and it was, took all the energy in my body not to just yell it out before the trial, but um, I was robbed last year and one of the perplexing things that was stolen from me, along with a lot of other very personal items that I can't replace, was a copy of an altered art Gaga Gaga Cowboy that I made and it was signed by the voice actor Spike and everything and it was ripped off my wall. Um, along with a lot of other things. Um, the community was so gracious in helping me replace things. And on top of that, months down the road, uh, my roommate, who was also affected by this, decided to just open up, offer up, and type in the word ga ga ga, just out of complete curiosity. And the item appeared. And we found the seller. We noticed that they had the same apartment layout as us. Uh, we saw them welcome mat outside, we are like, oh my god, this is our neighbor. Uh, I, I contacted the West Covina Police Department, who they were extremely diligent about it. They put out the warrant almost immediately, and they caught the thieves, which is some poetic justice, because usually these kind of burglaries, people get away with them. But in this instance, um, we were able to identify them because of that card. So that was incredible. But anyways, this is aside from what I wanted to update you guys on. I'm extremely excited to finally announce we have our cloth mats launched. This is something that we've been wanting to do for years now, and I know at this point, oh my god, cloth mats, everybody's doing cloth mats. Um, but this is something that's kind of like our baby, and we wanted to make perfect. We wanted to do something like for the players, by the players. And so over here, I have already opened up. Um, this is the box that it comes in. The company name is Pyramid. Now if you can see some of the gloss. It's like a nice box you can store it in and put in your backpack. And in the box, I'm going to show you guys some close-ups of this, is the Dark Magician Girl playmat that I designed. Um, the thing that was most important to us was quality. Quality as in side stitches so that the mat doesn't fray high quality material, which it's it's so soft, and but it's sturdy at the same time, and high quality printing. This ink is not gonna come off, so I'll show you guys some zoom-ins right there. And I also wanted to give away a couple things to everybody in the comment section, because I'm super excited to finally be working again. Um, I'm making copies of the original ink art that I made to be placed on the mat, and this will be maybe five to 10 copies I'll do and I'll sign them. So anybody in the comment section is up for grabs to get a copy of that. A couple other things I'm working on, if you guys see in the background, um, I'm doing this crazy matte collage that I did for my birthday. I did a 24 hour stream. Everybody who joined in picked a monster to contribute. And currently there's almost about 90 monsters on this mat. I only have like about 20 in, so I'm going to be finishing that up. And that's just a special event for the people who participated. Then there is an Akiza mat that I'm working on. That's going to be released in November or December. I'm working really hard on that. I kind of want it to make it like the best thing that I've ever painted so far. That's going to be a normal mat. And that's pretty much it right now. Um, I'm super excited to be posting videos again and <laughs> posting videos again every five okay anyways <laughs> posting videos again and um, I'm gonna be streaming on Twitch regularly again I have a lot that I need to catch up on this year's just been a hard year and I've been very sick but I'm okay now and I'm ready to fucking draw some more art so I'll see you guys soon take care bye